The Global Environmental Multiscale Model GEM, often known as the CMC model in North America, is an integrated forecasting and data assimilation system developed in the Recherche and Prévision Numérique RPN, Meteorological Research Branch MRB, and the Canadian Meteorological Centre CMC. Along with the NWS's Global Forecast System GFS, which runs out to 16 days, the ECMWF's Integrated Forecast System IFS, which runs out 10 days, the Naval Research Laboratory Navy Global Environmental Model NAVGEM, which runs out 8 days, and the UK Met Office's Unified Model, which runs out to 6 days, it is one of the five predominant synoptic scale medium range models in general use. Topic. Operation Topic. Deterministic model The GEM's operational model, known as the Global Deterministic Prediction System GDPS, is currently operational for the global data assimilation cycle and medium-range forecasting, the regional data assimilation spin-up cycle and short-range forecasting. Mesoscale forecasts distributed under the names Regional Deterministic Prediction System or RDPS for the coarser mesh and high-resolution Deterministic Prediction System or HRDPS for the finer mesh are produced overnight and are available to the operational forecasters. A growing number of meteorological applications are now either based on or use the GEM model. Output from the GEM goes out to 10 days, on par with the public output of the European Integrated Forecast System. Topic. Ensemble model The ensemble variant of the GEM is known as the Global Ensemble Prediction System GEPS. It has 20 members plus control and runs out 16 days, the same range as the American Global Forecast System. The GEPS runs alongside the GFS Ensemble to form the North American Ensemble Forecast System. A regional ensemble prediction system reps, covering North America and also having 20 members plus control, runs out 72 hours. Topic. Development The GEM model has been developed to meet the operational weather forecasting needs of Canada for the coming years. These presently include short-range regional forecasting, medium-range global forecasting, and data assimilation. In the future they will include nowcasting at the meso scales, and dynamic extended range forecasting on monthly to seasonal timescales. The essence of the approach is to develop a single highly efficient model that can be reconfigured at run time to either run globally at uniform resolution with possibly degraded resolution in the other hemisphere, or to run with variable resolution over a global domain such that high resolution is focused over an area of interest. Topic. Mechanics The operational GEM model dynamics is formulated in terms of the hydrostatic primitive equations with a terrain following pressure vertical coordinate h. The time discretization is an implicit two-time level semi-Lagrangian scheme. The spatial discretization is a Galerkin grid point formulation on an Arakawa C grid in the horizontal lat -lon, and an unstaggered vertical discretization. The horizontal mesh can be of uniform or variable resolution, and furthermore can be arbitrarily rotated. The vertical mesh is also variable. The explicit horizontal diffusion is minus 2 on all prognostic variables. 
The operational GEM model is interfaced with a full complement of physical parametrizations. These currently include solar and infrared radiation interactive with water vapor, carbon dioxide, ozone and clouds, prediction of surface temperature over land with the force restore method, Turbulence in the planetary boundary layer through vertical diffusion, diffusion coefficients based on stability and turbulent kinetic energy. Surface layer based on Monin Obakov similarity theory. Shallow convection scheme, non precipitating. Kuo type deep convection scheme, global forecast system. Fritz Chappell type deep convection scheme, regional forecast system. Sunquist condensation scheme for stratiform precipitation Gravity wave drag Topic. Future The next stage of development of the GEM model is to evaluate the non-hydrostatic version for mesoscale applications where the hydrostatic assumption breaks down. The limited area open boundary version is scheduled to follow. The distributed memory version of GEM is almost completed. It is a major recoding effort that is based upon a locally developed communication interface currently using message passing interface. Research on the performance of different land surface schemes such as ISBA interaction soil biosphere atmosphere and class Canadian land surface scheme is making progress. The strategy is progressing towards a unified data assimilation and forecast system at the heart of which lies a single multipurpose and multiscale numerical model. Topic. Usage Output from Canadian forecast models such as the GEM is under Canadian Crown copyright but is issued under a free license if properly attributed to Environment Canada. Various unofficial sites thus redistribute GEM data, including the GDPS and GEPS. Topic. See also Global climate model